I don't even know how to start this thing. What's happening, guys? I'm sitting at the staircase of our newest listing in North Palm Beach. But you know what? Let me get up. Because I'm not going to show you this house today. No, he's going to show you this house. And can you count how many times he says the word here, here, here in this video? Here. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Here. And you're not the only one that's here. Denise, are you here? I'm here. There's two floors. Why don't you do downstairs? Denise goes upstairs. Is that cool? Let's do it. Here we are, Prosperity Harbor in North Palm Beach. I'm going to show you guys the inside, but before we get up there, I want to show you guys this here. Here we have pavers that go all the way up the driveway, which is pretty cool. A nice touch in this community. You don't see that a lot. What's happening up there? I don't know. What's going on, Denise? If you couldn't wait. No. Show us inside the house. Yeah, nice tall entryway here. Hey, come on in. Here we are. Well, we got hardwood floors here, tall ceilings through all the living areas. So to the left here, you got a guest bathroom, right? If you ever have any guests over, perfect. They don't have to go upstairs. They could use this. This looks like it's the what? The primary bedroom here on the first floor. You don't got to go upstairs. Everything's down here. You're by the kitchen. You're by everything. Nice in here on, on the first floor. Super tall ceilings. His and hers closets that are over here as well. So which one would be hers? Oh, no doubt. <laughs> Welcome in. <laughs> and this is the primary bathroom. Mm -hmm. Nice tall ceilings again. And this shower is super cool. All the light you could possibly want. Nice and wide in here. Tons of natural light. But still private too, you know? Private. Yeah, yeah. I'll tell you what, this bathroom will motivate me to work out. It's so great. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I gotta look good in here. <laughs> the shower and the jacuzzi tub. Mm -hmm. And then obviously your toilet with every bathroom. And so much counter space on here, Chris. I mean, look how wide this thing is. What room is this right here? Yes, this is your formal dining area. Chandelier here for if you ever have a nice long table with family over, it's perfect for that. Yeah, I can just imagine that maybe even over there in a the little cubby, maybe like a little wet bar or a mm -hmm. table or something mm -hmm. like that. Looks like it's right off of what was it, like a sitting room or a living room? Yeah, okay, your living room over here. You got sliders if you want to go out to the backyard area so you can bring the party inside and out. But behind this wall here, you have the kitchen. But you also have your family room, more of your laid back, hangout, family room area where you can have parties, whether it's Super Bowl Sunday, football games, whatever it is. You got speakers up here in the family room area. You would have maybe a less formal kind of table here for maybe morning breakfast. If you wanted to also, you could do some bar stools here by the long countertop and kind of have everyone in here together. And look at the size of this kitchen. Holy cow. This thing is humongous. Yeah, it's huge. Stainless steel appliances. You got an island here for some extra storage, as well as extra countertop space if you're prepping food. Double ovens over there. Gas stove top here. What else is gas? The water heater is gas. What is this for a hotel? <laughs> I think it's. I said the same. I've never seen one that big ever. That's crazy. That's what she said. <laughs> hey Chris, check out the size of this laundry room. All right, now say it like you're excited. Now Chris, check out the size of this laundry room here. This thing could be like another bedroom. Plenty of storage in here, cabinets that go down the whole side here. Like, I'm just up in awe of how big this is. That's what she said. <laughs> right? Pretty big, yeah. Okay, I noticed another door. Oh, right there? Yeah, I ran into it. I just ran into it. You know, this is the door I was talking about on the brain. Another bedroom on a bedroom. No, I'm just kidding. It's storage. So that's on the staircase. Obviously. Yeah, yeah. Dude, how much? If you need to store stuff, this is the place. Mm hmm So what's behind the door I just ran into? That would be your an extended two-car garage. Two plus. Two plus, because you have the additional storage area here. That door over there is Hurricane Impact garage door, which is super nice. You also have steel panel shutters that come with the home for hurricane protection, which hopefully you don't have to use. But if you do need it, we got them all here. Where are you going to Upstairs with Denise. Oh, is she ready? I don't know. I hope so. Yeah, hold on. Huh? Okay. <laughs> well, let's go. Which way do you want to start? Well, that way is bigger, so let's start over here. It's another primary bedroom. Like, Cody showed you the primary downstairs when you first came in, but upstairs we have the second primary. So as you come in, this is also the balcony that I saw you guys initially on. Oh, that's where you were? This is where I was. So you do have this nice view outside. You can fit about two chairs, maybe a small table. But like I said, it's the primary upstairs. You have your bathroom, full bath, and then you have your walk-in closet over here. So let's go see the other side. 
Take me to the other side. So as you come up here, this is your loft. It can be your TV room, your movie room, or you can have it into an office. The five little square windows up top. Natural light. Natural it. light also overlooks your dining room. You can see your main living room and your entryway. Come on. Over here, we have the other two bedrooms. I love it because you do have another patio on the outside that you overlooks your pool. That is cool. I want to see it. Come on, hurry up. So it's like a... Jack and like Joe. a Jack and Jill patio? What's behind the door right there? It's another walk-in closet. I think this was bigger than in my childhood room. Across the hall, before we go to the other room is... It's a second bathroom. Hey. Double sink, full shower, tub. So I like that there's a door in case Denise is going... Pooping. <laughs> Pooping. <laughs> you can still be over here doing your thing. So now this is your fourth bedroom. And like you see, we were outside in the other bathroom. Uh, can I do that over? So this is your third bedroom on the second floor. Like we were in the other room, your patio, just the wraparound where it comes out, so it also overlooks your pool. You do have two red... Uh, why well, can't get this one? This woman can't speak. Uh, Ooh. Hey, what's in there? And I love this closet because it has the built-in shelves. All right, who's going to show us the pool area? Let's go see. Going to the patio? Up to you. It doesn't matter. I'll do it. You got plenty of space here, here, here for a little bit of furniture if you want to have some family or friends over. So this door inside, you can have the party inside, outside. You have a pool with a nice waterfall feature on the back side. And even some more additional room over here on the side as well. And if you have a dog, there's additional space over on that side. So you got the trees, so it's private. You don't have any neighbors looking at you. Well, one really awesome feature about this neighborhood is that they have day docks. If you have a boat, this public marina is almost everywhere around here. If you wanted to come to your house during the day, say you forgot something, there are day docks in this community. You can just drive your boat up, park your boat, go to your house, get what you need, head back out on the water. It's really, really cool. So if you want to check out this house, reach out to us. Our information's on the screen. <laughs> we'll love to show you this house. See ya. <laughs>